on to the masses of the people. We've created extraordinary institutions. The people have participated in creating these institutions for economic development. And the economic development, we engage in what we call dual and contending power. Not just dual power, but a power of our own that contends with colonial power. Because the contradiction is that our lives, economically and politically, are controlled by foreign and aliens. The struggle has to be to take our lives back. The struggle has to be to be able to create and recreate life for ourselves. Because it's not that black people don't create life and recreate life. We just don't create it for us. If your refrigerator is empty, if you don't have food to feed your babies, it's not because there's no food in the refrigerator. It just ain't in your refrigerator. It's in the refrigerator of the colonizer. It's the colonizer who's starving our children, starving our people, etc. Colonialism must die. And this is the thing that makes us a problem. Africa must be free. And I mean this in a literal sense of the world. African people, black people who brought human life and civilization to the planet Earth. We must be free. We must reclaim our dignity. And there's no such thing as a dignified slave that's not engaged in the struggle to kill the slave master and overturn the system of slavery. You cannot have any dignity. You cannot have any dignity without that.